Hello everybody, welcome back to another Canva video. In this one, I wanna to talk to you about their new AI functionality. In particular, we're gonna try magic design and I'm gonna show you that this is not only awesome technology or awesome AI, we're gonna create an example or a sample wedding photo slash wedding invitation in seconds and it's going to be great. And I'm gonna show you how to do that with no design skills, no coding, nothing. All right, with that out of the way, the first step is you gotta to go to canva.com and then forward slash magic design. It doesn't appear to be on the homepage at the moment, so I'll put a link in the description below. Once you're on this page, click on try magic design. Once you're here, you're gonna have a few options. You'll see here, you could start by uploading an image and then it's just gonna come up with some ideas for us. Awesome, click on try it out. Here we go. Now, this is the magic part, try magic design. It's in beta, but it's going to give us ideas and templates and crafted ideas with the image that we use. So I'm gonna go to pexels.com and I, I searched for wedding and I just want a wedding image so we can do wedding because that's common. That's why people use Canva a lot. So there you go. I clicked on a free stock image. I clicked the download button here and there we go. I'm gonna go ahead and grab it in my finder and then I'm gonna go back in here. I'm gonna go click on insert media. I'm gonna grab that image and drag and drop it on drop files to support or to upload, pardon me. <laughs> that's what I meant to say. Once I do that, it runs its magic for me and look at that. It did this in seconds, I mean literally. I mean, this is an Instagram post. If we wanted to change all this up, we could, but there it's got its dates, it's got its time, it's got its designs there. It's all ready to go. Here's a wedding, intimate wedding. I could say this is a, a, a discount wedding, whatever the hell that is, I don't know what that is. This is a save the dates type one, it looks quite nice. This one's a bit of a mess, but we could totally fix that. But anyways, you see here, we've got eight awesome candidates. I'm partial to this one here, but here's the thing. If you don't like it, or if you want to re-roll and get some other ideas, just keep in mind, you can click on this media button, choose a file, and if you have a different image you want to try, just drag and drop it in there and it will run it again. You can also click on this style option, and if you have a specific style in mind, for example, this uses the default style, but if I wanted to use some cool coloring, like let's say I had a color uh, set or style that I wanted to go with, you can go ahead and add in your own colors, or I could just click on something like wedding here, and then click on see results and see what we get, see if they're a little different, not too much different, but anyways, that's all you need to do. Now, let's say you have a particular one you like. This one is an Instagram post. Let's go with this one, it's pretty simple. I'm just gonna click on it, and now I'm just gonna click on customize this post, or customize this template. It's literally that easy. Now, all we gotta do is just click on it and make some changes. So, if your name is not Hannah, and your name is, I don't know, Curtis, for example, it's Hannah and Curtis's wedding, and you wanted to say save the date, but the date isn't July 10th, it's something else, you just double click, and change the date. I'm gonna to go to July 30 instead of instead of that date. And it's literally that easy. You have no skills required. If you wanna zoom in like I have here, you can go, it's at 11772 Canada Drive. Oops, something like that, Canada Drive. I mean, whatever you wanted to say, zoom in, zoom out, that's literally all there is to it. If you wanna change the colors, I'll just click on the background here. You'll see the black is selected, but you wanted to have a nice pink wedding, well, there you go, we got a pink wedding. It's like that. If you want a different font, just click on the name here, but you don't want Playfair Display. You really like, I don't know, you like Railway Font? Done, Railway Font it is. This is all there is to it, to creating high quality stuff. Once you're done, just click on this little share button up the top there, and then click on download, and you can select a style, JPEG or PNG. I'm gonna go with JPG, download it. Let's see what we get. I'm gonna click on it when it's done. Remember, this is an Instagram post, so it's in, it's automatically in the correct size for Instagram. Click on it. We have it. That is literally how to create a wedding invitation in 90 seconds with Canva's new AI. Thanks for watching.